Now, that debate, the LGBTQ debate, uh, the one following the Supreme Court ruling, giving a thumbs up to the registration of LGBTQ plus body, that debate is continuing. It's an emotive subject, of course, drawing varied, varied reactions, particularly among the political and also uh, roping in the religious leaders. And as that debate rages, a section of Kenyans are tonight appealing to the president, President William Ruto, to pronounce himself on this matter. Why? So that it brings down the temperatures of the brainstorm. Our reporter Ruth Wamboy went out to get a sense of what people are thinking and this is the report that she filed. <laughs> Tuesday afternoon in the streets of Nairobi. The hustle and bustle of normal city life was a buzz amid the brainstorm over the Supreme Court ruling, giving a nod for the registration of gay rights and lesbians' body. Whereas political and religious leaders have been vocal on the matter, it was time to pick Wanjiku's thought on the emotive subject. Mambo kama haya ikubaliki hapa na rais wetu lazima pia ongelee ili jambo. Hivyo ndivyo ilikuwa Sodom na Gomora, Sodom na Gomora kaangamizwa. Na hivyo tukiendelea hivi hata sisi Kenya hatutakosa kuangamizwa. Kila mtu asimame kivi yake, watoto wako uwaonyeshe njia ambayo inatakikana na pia wewe usimame in the right way. Those we spoke to appear to be reading from the same script as their leaders terming the decision of the Apex Court as a push by Western countries to destabilize existing cultural norms. Church Muku na awe nsake wanastahili wachiulise. Wakiweka hao wanawake wawiri pamocha. Watasaa mtoto ama watatoa mbegu ama wanaume wawiri wakiwekwa pamoja. Watatoa mbegu. Kenyan speaking also on the ruling also took issue with legislators for allegedly failing to prioritize the discussion in parliament. Tumewachagua mtupeleke kwa njia iliyo mbora lakini saa hii mnatuweka kwa mashimo watoto wetu tutawalea aje tunaudhi Mungu na tunasiti tutasiti kuchapa fichapo mnaona mvua inyeshi nisi tabia zenye tunafanya kwa hivyo tafadhali tunaomba wakubwa wale wanaongoza hii nchi kwa kuwa na hekima ya Mwenyezi Mungu. But now what we are trying to see here is a, is something is a, is a it is a, it is something that is not even protective for us and uh, as youths and even uh, as Kenyans uh, at, at large it was the same situation in Bungoma county residents are happy with the decision saying it will set a bad precedence and expose the country to immoral practices Africa <laughs> I, I make sense. Sasa hiyo ni kama kumaliza mamba ya kusana. Hiyo manene atutaki. Tuwe ipaki tuka wasungu, sisi wa Afrika wate tuwane vile tunawanana. <laughs> this as Migori County Bishop Sakot condemned the Apex Court appealing for President William Ruto to issue an executive order to rescind the decision. This one is coming against the expectation of God Almighty who is having the powers. We are the Esther of this country. We are the Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego. We shall say no. no, no it no. doesn't matter what happens. On Friday 24th February 2023, the Supreme Court of Kenya under a five-judge bench ruled that the LGBTQ community have the right to association. It is clear that the Supreme Court decision has act many, while many are shy to speak about the subject matter publicly. It is evident that the debate will be a subject for discussion for months to come. Ruth Wamboy reporting for Prime Edition from the County of Nairobi.